Look at our light bulb we're gonna draw today. This has kind of rounded at the top, but it comes down into like a little bit of a rectangle. Then we're gonna curve the bottom, put some threads at the bottom, and we've got that piece inside, which is what starts to glow when you turn the light on. And notice around it, all the marks that can indicate that brightness. Now, this is a great thing you'll draw when you want to say, like, oh, I have an idea. And you draw a light bulb, like, bing, the light went on. Okay, let's start drawing. I'm going to go in pencil so that I can just kind of get it done. Then later, I'll kind of trace it. Now, when we do it, we're going to start with the top, and we just want kind of a gentle curve. Okay, I'm a little wonky up here, so I'm going to trim it down a little bit. Wonky, that's an art term. And you know what, you get to adjust things before you go to make your final. There you go, okay, I'm a little wonky on that side, but we're good. There we go, okay. I'm gonna go down the same amount on both sides, and don't worry if it's not perfect. There you go. We have a little rounded tip at the bottom where it gets screwed in, and we have some lines that kind of show the places where you would, you know, screw that in. Now to put the loops on it, we're going to give ourselves a couple of guidelines, so very lightly. And watch this, kind of fun. I'm gonna go up one side. I'm gonna make a loop. Then I'm gonna make the middle loop. I'm gonna end right here. And I'm gonna come up this side, and I want this loop to run right into it. Ta-da, I did it. Now I'm gonna plan my little line glow around it, but I want to give myself a space. There we go. And off of that, I'm going to put the little glow lines, but it looks, you want those lines to be kind of uneven, but they should all start at the same place. Okay, now let's trace it in some Sharpie, and then we'll erase our guidelines. Let's see if I can straighten out my bulb here. Always turn your paper when you're doing a curved piece. There, it's easier for your hand to go. Erase our guidelines. And we dust off all the crumbs from our eraser. A little bit more there. And now we're going to make add some color. I want it to be extra bright around the edges. Ready? Go! Whoa! Remember to like the video and subscribe to our channel. We've got so many more videos for you.